you must pray. The reason why you are praying too much now, you are praying too much, you don't sleep. Eh? True, sir. You don't sleep, but you must pray uh, for God to use you to destroy this thing that in your family they used to worship. That's true, sir. Eh? True, sir. I mean, I'm just seeing a stone here now. That's true, sir. Eh? And these people, they go and kneel down there. That's true, they sir. They are worshiping a stone. That's true, eh? sir. Sometimes they break some things there. That's, that's true, sir. Eh? That's true. So that's the thing that is blocking you. They say the way you are now yes, sir. is because of this thing. Yes, sir. So I will tell you, I'm going to separate you with this thing. Uh, let, me, let me pray for you, Paul. Let me pray for you, brother. It's like you are praying too much, but you are, you are beaten by a stone. You are free. I'm Apostle George. I'm coming from Malawi, but I'm residing in Deben. That's where I am ministering at the moment. I confirm the prophecy to be true hundred percent because I'm a prayerful man of God. And uh, 2018, I faced a lot of battles uh, and betrayal from uh, those I was believing that they are together with me in the ministry to raise the gospel. And uh, I face even death of my young brother, uh, the death that up to now, I don't know how it happens. So it was a year that things were not good for me. And uh, as the professor comes today, I believe that God is taking me to the next level because God want to use you as man of God said. And uh, I confirm that prophecy to be true 100%. It affected me. Uh, including my marriage with my wife. We had a lot of misunderstanding. We had a lot of battles. We were nearly about to divorce each other because of the conflicts that I didn't know where they're coming from. As a man of God revealed to me that some people were throwing stones in me, meaning that there was things that were happening in the darkness room that I couldn't see. And uh, I knew that once I came here, uh, to this arena, I will receive my revelation, my prophecy, and uh, I trust God that I will not just come from Deben to come to Tembisa without receiving my prophecy. So I trust God that today is my day of receiving my prophecy, and uh, I know that from today, a yoke that we are blocking my progress has been broken down and I know 2019 it will be a year of expansion and my ministry will glow like never before.